In this week's video on Flowworks, we're going to be doing another Procreate painting. This is just one that I've digitally produced this week. Haven't had too much time this week off camera to do different paintings. Yeah, I only managed to get one done this week, so that's a little bit of a disappointment. But today we're going to be looking at creating another square piece, but this is going to be quite minimal. I just want to sort of see if I can produce something contemporary ultra modern. I mentioned in some of my previous videos that less is more sometimes. So yeah, I want to sort of strip everything back to create something digital, but that's a little bit more contemporary. So you can download this color set for this week's painting. This is going to be the color set here. In the description is a link to the website that will take you to this piece of art where you'll also be able to download this color set. So feel free to do that and then follow along to this video and create your piece of art on the iPad. So we've got a canvas of 500 by 500, everything's blank on it. And we're just gonna start off by filling this first color. So the whole layer is just gonna be in this light color. So we just click on the color, we'll click on the fill. We're gonna fill that layer mask. Next, we're gonna add another layer over the top of that. And I'm just gonna make some marks on top of this layer that make it slightly more whiter as well. And then we're gonna pick up on one of the slightly darker colors. If I be honest, loving you the hardest thing to do, so I keep to myself. I feel like I'm falling in and out of consciousness. Yeah. Now we starting to talk, let's kill another progress. Really hard to process, you treat me like an object. Baby, we toxic, can we stay on topic? I feel like we lost it, feel like we lost it. Take my love, don't waste it Even though I don't mind waiting Late test my mind racing What else I have to do, girl? I only want you I only want you, yeah I only want you I only want you Pull me closer Okay, so we've got that initial mark making. Now we're going to go in with another layer over the top of that. And this is where we're going to go a little bit more bolder with the colors. And I just want to create a shape that I can fill in with that color. And that's just going to sort of come up from this side. And then we can just select that and fill that color. I'm going to do exactly the same again, but go quite black on this one. I'm just going to sit over the top of that. Just go back to that first layer and I just want to add one more piece in here. Okay, then we're going to alpha lock one of these layers and we're just going to add a bit of texture into it. Okay, on this black one, we're gonna use the erase tool with a texture on it, and we're just gonna break up some of that shape. We can do the same by using the texture and smudge it as well into the shape. I'm just trying to create a little bit of unity between these two different shapes and layers. to do the same again turn alpha lock off on the layer behind it so on these two blue pieces and again we're just going to break up certain areas of it okay we've got our element of color and this sort of brings your eye into it to this sort of section here. Now we're just gonna add one more 
layer on top of everything. And I'm gonna use a calligraphy pen brush, to make it quite small. And we're gonna use one of those gray greens. And this is where I'm gonna introduce some shape over the top of this design. And this is what will sort of tie everything in and make it look really contemporary and modern. So we're just going, going to go in with a simple shape and then I'm just going to use that as a base of the design and play about with the different thicknesses and brush colours as well just to sort of try and replicate roughly that shape again. Just letting that shape interact a little bit with this and it's sitting over the white so it really sort of gives unity to this concept. And then we're going to go with one of the real dark colours and maybe there's one big brush line that comes down this side. And then we're just going to apply some of that same element of design but over this corner so then it really ties everything in. So same principle again. I wonder if you'd stay If you knew the things I've kept away And then on that layer, if we turn I on the alpha lock, we can then apply some texture colour within that. So for this side, I'm going to pick up on some of these beigey colours and I'm just going to tap in on that black sort of section. Just how needed you. So what this is doing now, it's sort of unifying everything together. And then the same over here, you can click on some of the greens. I was falling fast into the ground. So there it is, it's a real simple, abstract, contemporary piece of art. Something really simple, quick and easy for you to create in Procreate. You don't have to really think about it, you just want to create something that your eye draws your attention to, which was this area here, and then applying the overlaid line marks over the top really sort of then unifies this into one contemporary piece of art. If you place your artwork in a living space environment, you can really gauge how modern this piece of art or your piece of art is going to look. So if you like the sound of all that, I've got some really exciting videos coming up in the future. I'm going to be doing a series of videos shortly for the Samsung Frame TV, which is an ultra modern smart TV that also doubles up as a picture frame for your living space. And we're going to be creating some exciting art for the Samsung TV and I'm going to be showing you how to then get that art onto your TV and have that in your living space. So some real exciting stuff coming up. And if modern and contemporary art is something that you're into, please subscribe to this channel. My name's James, the channel is Flowworks. Hit the bell notification every single Wednesday, you'll be reminded of a new video that I release at 8 p.m. But until next week, then YouTube is suggesting your next video to watch right here. I wonder if you'd stay If you know the things I've kept away